Well, hey, I thought I'd come back on. I just finished the 5K that I did. I walked it. <laughs> My goal was to do it in under an hour, 59 minutes. But let me tell you something. You know, there are people out there who probably didn't even want to try because they were afraid they'd come in last or be embarrassed, you know, by how they placed or whatever. You know what? It's okay. And I walked with this girl who's probably almost a third of my age. And um, we talked the whole way. It was so interesting. And we're thinking of doing the no, the uh, Thanksgiving Day turkey trot together, walking it, of course. Now, my daughter walked with me, but she went ahead and she was up a little bit ahead talking with uh, a mom who's child is in the class of one of her children and because she saw I was talking with this girl we had a lovely time and no I didn't place but you know what I finished and that's what was important to me especially with bad knees and an aroma in my foot but I did okay I made it I was number 15 it was a 5k so I mean it was look at that when I looked at this map, I thought, oh my gosh, that's a long way. And it was a long way, and it was not easy. Uh, walking with this other girl kept me going a lot faster than I would have if I was on my own. But now I'm back home, getting ready to take a nice Epsom salt bath. But before I do, I thought, let me try this Vivida coffee. Now, this is something you're going to see that you don't see on other Nespresso coffees a nutrition facts panel. And why is that? Because this Vivita coffee, which is an intensity of six, it's a 7.77 .77 ounce Virtuo coffee, has vitamin B12 in it, 20% of your daily requirement. Now, sometimes I take B12, you know, if I'm particularly run down or something. So usually you take one of these tablets and it has five times the amount that this coffee has. So let's open this up and see, oh wait, does it say anything on it? Nespresso Vivida invites you to a coffee ritual where the smooth taste of fine Latin American Arabicas meets the benefit of vitamin B12. Vitamin B12 helps to support immune health. Complemented by the blends bourbon variety beans, luxurious sweet cereal note, Vivita is your treat for a great day. Well, I'm already having a great day. Let's see if it can be even greater. Okay, so there's the little capsule with almost sort of a sunburst on it. Okay, let's move this in over here. And I get my Virtuo machine. And let's see, maybe I shouldn't move this. All right, can we see it? There we go. Okay. So, of course, I'm going to brew this black first. And by the way, when this says that it's got, um, what, bourbon, variety beans, no, no liquor in here. It's um, where it's from, and I think the way that it's, you know, just a variety of... Uh, you know how different plants have different varieties? Like you can, got, you can get different kinds of tomatoes, you know, like Big Boy or Better Boy or, I don't know, there's all these different names. Well, there's different kinds of coffee beans too. So here we go on this, and I'm looking forward to tasting this. Uh, never thought about getting my nutrition from coffee, but hey, you know, I give it a whirl here. Let me get a spoon. All righty. Oh, looks like it's going to have a lot of crema. So this is a regular size cup. It's almost eight ounces. And, oh yeah, I forgot. I'm so used to my Pixie machine, you know, the little one that just takes a few seconds, but this is a much larger cup, so it's going to take longer. Okay, we're almost done here. 
So I'm looking forward to trying this. You know, I would think that they would give an approximate caffeine count on here since there's a nutritional panel. But no, it says Vivita, rich in vitamin B12 to help support immune health. You know, honestly, I think this is one of these just, hey, Nespresso, let's jump on the bandwagon of, you know, the whole health craze these days. Um, I'm sure that's what this is, but hey, that's okay. So, um, I always taste the crema. I've just, out of curiosity, and it's always so bitter. Oh, <laughs> because it has the concentrated oils in it. That, that give the coffee its flavor. And when the coffee is run under pressure or in the case of the Virtuo machine under centrifugal force, which, you know, causes pressure too, um, although it's not the same as the pressure used for the espresso in the uh, original line machines or in a real espresso maker. Um, so it's not the same pressure, but still it has the same effect, which is to cause the oils to kind of bind together with carbon dioxide and form a sort of a coffee bubble bath here. So I'll give this a taste. It's okay, you know, it tastes like black coffee, but the nice thing is it's smooth. It's not like having black coffee, you know, like if you went to a restaurant and said, I just like a coffee black. Um, a lot of American coffees, you know, regular coffees, sort of have a bitterness. This is not bitter. This is yummy. Now, I am going to warm up some... Oh, I don't, maybe I don't have to warm milk up. This is a big enough cup. Let me get some milk. Now, as you know, I use almond milk. So I've got some silk, 30 calorie per cup, almond milk. I usually like a pretty milky coffee, but I don't want to end up cooling this off too much. Uh, you can always obviously pop it in the microwave, but when you do that, it ends up um, making some of the, it, it's just, it takes away from the taste of your coffee. Would I notice that? Probably not. <laughs> but, mm. Okay, this is nice. You know what I think would be nicer though? I'm gonna add a little half and half to it because I think I would like more of a sensation on my tongue. Sometimes having a little bit of a, you know, thickness on your tongue makes a difference. So yeah, I wore shorts today for, for the road race. So I'm going to pull them down a little bit here so you know I'm wearing something under the shirt. <laughs> um, because it was a very pleasant, what is it, like 64 degrees. It's been that ever since this morning when we had the race. Very overcast fall type of day. But hey, 64 felt good wearing shorts and the shirt. Yes, okay, this is good. This hits the spot. It's just, you know, I would say it's a nice cup of coffee. If you wanna get your vitamin B12 this way, well, by all means, go for it. Anyway, so I just wanted to give this a little review for you and give you the results of my road race today. <laughs> um, Okay, well, I hope you have a great day. I'm headed for the bathtub. <laughs>